What have you got? Well, what have I got? Um, a new reality show uh, using kids. Kids are famous chefs cooking. There's too many cooking shows already. I want something fresh and edgy. Our ratings are crap. I got it. What about a new renovation show? We'll call it Extreme Bathrooms and Kitchen. It's all the rage in the States at the moment. Extreme. You're talking about a home renovation show here. We're not talking about blowing things up or building a kitchen on a sheer cliff face or out of a moving train. You're talking about a home reno show? That's all it really is. Yeah, I suppose. Every station's got a hundred cooking and renovation shows. It's been done to death. If you don't produce something good, your jobs are on the line. What have you got, David? Undercover reality show. Tell me more. Let's work with you. See where we go. Can, uh, can we make it a competition? Yes, cash prize. Um, maybe they could go undercover at their workplace. I like it. But not the workplace. It's boring. We've got to push the envelope more here. It's got to be sexy. Drug smugglers. Drug smugglers and bikies. There's nothing more sexy at the moment than bikies. And besides, everybody loves to hate bikies and drug smugglers. Bikies? Give me more. Dave? The way I see it, boss, it's an undercover reality contest. We get our contestants to go undercover in our own kind of police force in real undercover situations. We mirror what the real police do. Mirror? We'll call it Mirror Force. Yeah, and, and the first contestant to successfully infiltrate the bikies and the drug smugglers will win something like, I don't know, uh, 50 grand? It, it might be too dangerous. I mean, couldn't people get hurt? No, that won't be a problem. I mean, we'll get ex-cops. We'll get a security team, a surveillance team. They can video log their progress, and we'll have cameras everywhere. I mean, it's too easy. Done. Let's pull out all stops on this, David. I want the pilot on my desk in six weeks. Mirror Force is the new sensation in reality TV. Blending Big Brother, Cops and Underbelly, we take you undercover for real as contestants use their wits against real criminals. So nervous. Meet Roger. Waiter by profession with an eye on the prize, he's taken up the challenge to go head to head with crims in real undercover operations. No, I don't have any concerns really. How could it be? I mean, you don't have to be Einstein to make it undercover. Uh, put the gift to the gab. I can talk my way out of pretty much any situation. And I've got nerves of steel. <laughs> well, it's day 19 undercover. It's day 25, and um, it looks like I've finally made a breakthrough getting into the group. They've got something for me to do. I'm gonna nail this. Stand by, stand by. Just shadow. I've got the eyeball. The target is getting off the boat now. Full security assets in place. This is it. Stay sharp, people. Stay with the primary target. Go to hack here. Do it exactly as I said. Take this to the city. We we'll meet him in Kingsway Lane at 1 a.m. Don't take a gun. Get this guy excited, he'll use it on you. You got it? Yeah, you got it. Walk into the city metro. I'll call you there if there's any change. Give us a look at your phone. Cops can track you with it. Oh shit! Got my bag. Got a meeting tonight, 1 a.m. in way lane. No guns allowed. It's a bus. Scary bastard. I think I can actually do this. I really do. Okay, Roger. Yeah. Okay, I'll be there. Okay, alright. Be there. Just changed the time of the meeting from 1am. It's now 11 pm tonight. You've got to be joking. That's in 30 minutes. We better get you wired and get the security team down there ASAP. Testing one, two, three. Yep, gotcha loud and clear. I can't raise the security team. You have to get going. I'll have security there ASAP. They won't be long. Sure, okay. I can't believe I'm doing this. Hey, I'm in position. Did you notice there's a dead in lane? 
Roger. You sound really faint. Your battery must be going flat. The security team will be there in 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Well, what if he turns up before then? Ed. Ed. Ed, are you there? Hello? Radio's flat. Ed, are you there? Get me out of here. Mate, you understand, we can't go ahead with the competition now. Not with all this. Uh, but look, thanks and uh, good luck, eh? Right, what do you got? 